You guys have seen this stud on the mound, but right now we got here Michael King. You ready to take a look at some of your top posts on social media? I can't wait. <laughs> All right, let's do it, baby. Oh, God. First one. Dude, you're a happy baby. I mean, that's the cutest baby I've ever seen. But also, <laughs> I'm like a spitting image of my father now. So I got that to look forward to. I was about to say, you really are spitting image. That's nuts. It's similar size forehead, you know, just, just good looking guys. Yeah, <laughs> I dig it, I dig it. You were this, really smiling in this picture right here, but. Yeah, that's the soft smile, you yeah. know, whatever. <laughs> it took me a while to actually post that. My mom made me post that thinking that it was actually gonna get a ton of likes. And I was like, there's no chance. And it ended up being one of my most liked post because I have that I'm my ambition is to be the starting shortstop I came close but not not there dude I was about to ask you what happened I know I'm still fighting for it you know really grinding at PFPs really trying to make <laughs> sure that my my fielding is up to par but uh I know I'm really upset with my uh, with myself for that. And what grade was this? Sixth grade. So my, okay. I went to elementary school and ended in sixth grade, and then middle school was just seventh and eighth. So that was like the graduation of elementary school. Okay. Now you had a little sweet tooth. What is this? Is this a cake? Is it what a donut? This is a Rhode Island <laughs> staple. So it's Alley's Donuts. Now I'm giving some sponsorship deals out. But All right. um, we're just signing them up. Who wants one? <laughs> they they do a donut cake that is like the best dessert I've ever had. Um, and so that's a donut cake and the pint of ice cream up top there, it was actually my dad's company, Gaga's. He uh, started that probably in like 2005 and he sold those pints in all different grocery stores and whatever for, I don't know, 15-ish years. And Dude, it, no way. Yeah, so that's the rainbow flavor. Yeah, that, lemon was uh, was the best seller. I think raspberry is my favorite, but yeah. All right, so is that flavor, did you inspire that flavor? Or did you have like any saying in the taste testing with your dad's ice cream? We made the, I never really had a saying in the taste testing. I was also too young to really take somebody's opinion. It's a sophisticated palate sherbet, you know? Um, <laughs> you got the terminology down. <laughs> <laughs> but I uh, I helped package and everything because when it just started out, we didn't have manufacturing, we, I say, we didn't have manufacturing or anything. So I was taking stickers and putting them on the on the lid and on the actual pint and wow. my dad would pay me like 25 cents an hour so I should be like suing him for child labor there but yeah that was that's what me and hey, my buddies did every now and then. You made a good investment because now look we're sitting in Yankee Stadium. <laughs> exactly. Shoot. Next one here you are in a BC hat and here's one of your boys Justin Dunn. You guys stay close to each other and that's kind of one of the things that you got at BC was that brotherhood. Oh yeah yeah the two people you cropped out of this are uh, all three of them are in my uh, in Sorry my, about that. <laughs> uh, in my bridal party. But yeah, Dun Dunny, so they were all my roommates. Dunny wasn't my direct roommate. Um, but then after college, after we got drafted, all throughout pro ball in the off seasons, we lived together, worked out in the off season. He's yeah, been my best friend since, since college. Amazing. All right, so you were in the BC uniform. Here you are in the Marlins one. This is the first non-smiling photo. Is there any uh, correlation with that in the uniform? We were trying no, I'm to. I'm just kidding, but this is a cool picture. <laughs> <laughs> we, we were trying to drop a pretty hard album yeah. there. Um, it does look like an album cover. You know, That's what I was getting at. We honestly didn't think that we were ever going to get a picture, and then somebody asked to take our picture, and we just posed like this. And then how about this, dude? Your That's first the first post with as the Yankees. Yankees. Yeah, that one I think definitely broke my like record when I first posted that. Um, but it, I mean, it's just surreal having the NY logo on all my gear and stuff. It, it, it was it's a good post. <laughs> all right, it's a like record. So he's got the stats down because so, these are all kind of like the top performing posts. So you you almost probably know what's coming next. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> oh man. Here's the Mike King smile that we all know. Which was that? I think that was just a random post, right? I didn't have like a cool. Yes, yeah, so that's a random that. post. But, but basically, I want to show that big smile in the Yankees uniform. Because I'm so happy to be a Yankee. Exactly. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's the fam. That's down in spring training uh, probably a couple years ago. And, um, I mean, I love having them come down to, to spring training. And they're my biggest supporters. So I, 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 uh, I always like taking pictures of them on the field. Dude, so cool. Now we know the story behind your dad. So there's the ice cream man. There's your mom. And your sister right there. She's got a little entrepreneur behind her as well. Oh, yeah. She's the star of the family. Um, she, yeah, I mean, unbelievable singer, awesome at social media. She always is on me for trying to post more. Uh, she posts like four times a day, so. Um, but I, I mean, her posts are hysterical. They're also musical, they're beautiful. It's, she, she's really good at social yeah, media. Yeah, she gets some great views and hopefully she approves of this uh, <laughs> segment that we're doing with. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Here's one of your posts. Yeah, yeah, so that's me, again, trying to do my best model walk in the background there, but so the, Obviously, my sister's the front there, and then that's May Star. So they created my walkout. My sister wrote it and thought that it'd be more lively, I guess, with a male rapper on top of it instead of her singing it. So she saw May Star a while ago and reached out to him saying, "Hey, I love your voice. Would love you to get on this 
on this track and see if we can kind of make it big. I like at one point too that you kind of see yourself smirk a little bit right there. Oh yeah, because like, I just man. feel so awkward. That's hey, you, more you, you pulled awesome. it off, man. You pulled it off. And then I had to get the, the smile going, or like the, <laughs> the straight face going, you know. But that that's in iHeartRadio. It's a cool, really cool area with the hallway and everything. Well, I'm sure your parents are very happy. <laughs> and uh, dude, oh, here we go. You're a big golfer. We see your golf swing all the time. I am, yeah, yeah. Golf is big on my social media. Um, I mean, my dad taught me when I was really young. My dad played at University of Southern California, um, and he's a great golfer. So that's it at Kiowa, and those are all my my Yankee buddies. We went on a great golf trip with JP Sears, who's now in A, oh, yeah. Brian Keller, who's in Japan, and Greg Weiser, who's up here now. So. Um, that it's a really good portion that we had there. I got a little nervous because I saw the picture at Pinehurst and some other pictures, but I'm like, I want to see the swing. I want to see any you do post your swing pretty often. <laughs> and we'll probably see a lot more of it on deck, which that is the I'm happiest sure this day is of probably life. the best performing post out of all of them. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, happiest day of my life, but also probably the most nervous I've ever been. Um, not that you would say no, but just it's a, it's a big moment, you know? We knew each other at Boston College. I uh, should also a BC grad, and, um, but never dated and so when we realized that we were both in New York I reached out and said hey you want to go grab a drink and that was our first date spot and so that night I planned it where she thought we were going out to dinner with actually my BC buddies and lo and behold it was this and then afterwards we did a, a engagement celebration um, at our second date spot and all those BC buddies and okay. her family and friends were all there it was, it was good dude that's a cool backstory <laughs> and I know that you're kind of tough on yourself and your music video skills but dude you pretty photogenic <laughs> look at the both of you right I, here, I, man. she's the one that that is the star of the show there out of everything that we see, what is your favorite part of social media? I mean, honestly, just showing off the people that I love. That's that's my thing. If I can shout out a teammate, if I can show off how beautiful my fiance is, if I can show off how supportive my family is, if I can show off how awesome my sister is at music or whatever she's into at the moment, um, that's my favorite part. All right, well, now's the time for the plug. Where can everybody follow you and what can they expect from your page? Yeah, uh, you can follow me at official Mike King on Instagram and I think it's 7 King or 14 on Twitter. I'm not as big on Twitter, um, but on, on Instagram, uh, you'll find a, a, a couple a couple good posts, uh, some sappy posts, some exciting posts. Um, but usually uh, I'm just uh, fun and, and I like a lot of pictures. So um, I'm, a, I'm a good follow. He is, I promise that. Dude, you're the man, appreciate you having awesome. me, brother. Thank you so much, I appreciate it. Yes, sir. <laughs>